Welcome! This is a Finally B Learning tutorial for the Waggle Google Translate widget. Here's what this lesson covers. What Waggle is as well as a look at the Google Translate widget which allows users to experience Waggle in up to 68 languages. So what is Waggle? Waggle is our lightweight candidate management system. It's simple and easy to use and works seamlessly across your desktop, tablet, or mobile. Let's get started. Here's the Waggle home page. Once you are logged in as a Waggle administrator, click on the profile icon and then select language. Here you'll see the languages that are available for users to select from. Note these will vary by organization. Let's choose Spanish for example. Notice the translation within the page. The Google Translation service works by sending the page off to Google, getting the translation, and updating the page. Let's try another page. If you click on the Manual Add button, you'll notice it appears in English first and then quickly updates as Google performs the translation. Let's try another language. I'm going to select Chinese for example. The page translates right away. Now let's perform a basic search. You'll notice the actual data within the profiles themselves is not translated, but the headings and anything within the system that is system text is. All the data the user entered remains in the original language it was entered in. Another nice feature appears when you hover over something that has been translated. Notice it displays the original text in English. Google's translation service is crowdsourced, so it actually allows people to contribute to better translation. So if this translation isn't ideal, Waggle users can always edit it and make changes by clicking on the Contribute a Better Translation button. Any suggestions are then submitted to Finally to review and potentially incorporate within Waggle. Great, let's switch back to English. Click on Admin, then on Settings. Here you'll see the Google Translation settings. Google supports 68 languages. Just click on the ones you'd like to support within your particular organization. If you turn off the switch, the system will hide all the languages, but it will remember all the languages you previously selected. So for example, let's add on a couple more languages. I'm going to select Afrikaans and Russian. Then hit save. It says your settings have been updated. Then refresh the page to update the widget. This time when you click select language, you will see those languages appear in the available options to select from. Great, feel free to switch back and forth between as many languages as you like. Waggle will remember the language you have selected and automatically use it for future visits. Here's a summary of what we've covered in this Waggle tutorial. We learned what Waggle is as well as a look at the Google Translate widget which allows users to experience Waggle in up to 68 languages. Thanks! I hope you've enjoyed watching. If you have any further questions, please ask our expert team by visiting finally.com help.